Good morning guys, welcome or welcome back to the vlog. If you guys are regular subscribers and watchers, you guys know how much I love these Gardein veggie sausage patties. I get hyper fixated on one item for breakfast and save it for like two or three months and then change it out when I get sick of it. The one thing I never get sick of and always have religiously in the morning is the celery juice from Jos. I also have to have B12 because I am vegetarian and have been for the last 12 years and definitely check with your doctor before you try any supplements, but that's just what I do. Now, I usually have classes around four o'clock until 10 o'clock a lot of nights. So this morning I kind of took it easy. I woke up at 8 a.m. and did my skincare, had some breakfast, did a workout. I actually filmed this workout so it'll be later on my channel live for you guys to try out. I haven't filmed a workout in forever so I thought that would be fun. I woke up this morning with a really painful friend on my face, a third eye if you will. And my go-to when I know I have a spot coming through is using this Himalayan charcoal clay mask. I feel like it does a really good job of getting into my pores and really drawing out all the toxins. So I did one of these for like 20 minutes. It says in the package to do it for 10 or 15 minutes but I left it on for longer because I wanted my skin to be super, super, super detoxified. And then I hung out with Luna. You can see she's licking a bunch and that's because she tried to lick my face mask off, which is cute, but we don't want that this morning. We don't want our little kitty ingesting clay mask. So I did not let her do so. I kept it on. I could not move my face for so long. I had to call my friend like this and I looked like a psychopath. Then I took it off. I worked on a thumbnail while I had it on, by the way, trying to stay productive while I'm simultaneously doing a face mask. And then I put on a little bit of light makeup because I was filming a workout today. And usually when I work out, I don't wear any makeup, but since I was filming one for YouTube, which will be up in a couple of days, I thought I would do a little bit of light makeup. I just did some eyeshadow here, you guys can see, trying to cut out my crease a little bit with this shimmery white powder. Obviously some lip gloss from Fenty Beauty. And of course, eyeliner also from Fenty Beauty. And I kept this whole part in, not edited, because I want to show you guys how I actually do it, because I get a lot of questions on my TikTok and Instagram how I do a water eyeliner. So feel free to rewind this video and watch it again. I basically take the corner of my eye, bring it to my eyebrow, and then attach it from my iris to that same corner, if that makes any sense. Then I put my hair up to get ready to work out because obviously I don't want hair on my face while I'm working out. Went downstairs, got ready, and put my ballet slippers on because again, today was gonna be a ballet workout for YouTube, but also for myself. I had lots of fun with this workout, especially in this new home gym situation that Steve made up. It looks so nice with the wall. It looks super industrial, super put together, may I add, and clean. I love this area so much. Plus it gets amazing lighting. So I was like, I have to film a video. This is a little bit of a snippet from the video that'll be up later this week. Comment down below, guys, what kind of workout you think it is, what I'm targeting, and if it's total body, if it's legs, if it's core, whatever it is, arms, comment down below and I'll tell you if I'm right and I'll heart the comment. I usually heart the comments anyways. I love all your comments. But yeah, comment down below what you think it is. Then it was finally time for a shower and you guys know my go-to's for my shower. I literally use the same things like every single time. So I'll try to put them in the link in the description because I always forget. By this point, it was close to 11 o'clock and I had a class at one. So I went out for a walk with Elsa at 11 so I could get back for lunch with Steven, which we actually ended up going to another town as a little day trip. This is the outfit I wore. Most of it is from Winners. The top is from Pink. The bottoms are from Winners. Elsa, actually, the sweater is from Roots. It's this like Whoa. velour soft sweater. I found some perfume in my bag, which was a really nice surprise because I thought I lost it. And of course I had to wear sunglasses to conceal my identity because I didn't want paparazzi stopping me and Elsa. I obviously listened to Harry Styles on the way because he is my future husband. Don't tell Steven. Now Jack Harlow is a second choice, I'd say. Um, obviously don't tell Steven any of this guys. But anyways, it was Earth Day as well today. So I took a little video of the little plant situation that's going on in our little town. Also for legal purposes, I was totally kidding in the last clip. Um, Steven is my number one pick. Anyways, we went to the post office. Unfortunately, nothing was in the post office for us because apparently we're not that famous yet. And then we had some lunch, which was just some leftovers from the night before, which was actually in the vlog previously, I believe, or one of my TikToks that I recently posted. Me and Steven shared a cellar juice on the way. I did force it down his throat because he does not like green things in juice at all in the slightest, I but I know it's good for him, so I know it's best for Steven. We got to the town, luckily nobody noticed us. I think it's partially because I'm with Steven. People are used to seeing me with Elsa and used to seeing me with Luna. I think in fact, Elsa's more famous than I am. But this town is actually very, very cute. It has this little moat throughout the whole center Hi. of the town with these houses across from it with little walkways. And then there's obviously the Ministry of Magic because where else would there be a Ministry of Magic apart from a really small rural town in Northern Ontario? Steven thought this area would be really nice for a photo op. Just kidding, he wanted to check it out as a boat launch because that's the kind of man he is. And because I'm the kind of woman I am, I asked him to take a little video slash photo of me while people watched us and gawked at us and thought we were crazy, but I think I look really cute and I think it turned out well. Good content. Happy Earth Day. And it was actually really beautiful today. Like it was so sunny, it was so inspiring, it was so nice because the last few days have been not so nice. <laughs> Can I keep that in? Oh, 
Because you took me here. You're running away from me. Oh, <laughs> oh, yeah. Soon it'll be warm enough that we can go kayaking. Mm-hmm. It's supposed to snow this week. It's a good thing I'm a world-class athlete and actually caught Steven because he was running quite fast in circles away from me, but I caught him, we got back home, we kind of hung out, we did work obviously because both of us has to work to keep the house and roof over our pets' heads. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Let me know in the comments down below what you thought and what you want to see next. Stay tuned for that workout coming out soon. Um, that will be posted in a couple of days. I love you guys. Thank you for watching. Stay safe and bye now.